What's going on out here, Jamie? Why is this so crucial and important that you're doing what you're doing right now? Uh, I think just getting students together for them to, uh, to have an outlook to talk, uh, to be able to share the emotions of, of all that they're experiencing. It's hard as adults to understand this emotion. And, and so you're asking 14, 15, 16, 17 year olds to, to understand it. And so just being around each other, strengthening one another, that's the, that's the biggest thing right now. Can you give us a little bit more timeline details about what happened when you heard the news and kind of involving the crash, just so people have a little bit more background? Yeah, I got the word yesterday that there was a crash with four uh, Columbia students and uh, two of them were soccer players and, and then later found out that one walked away and, and uh, one passed. Ages so, on those guys, how old are they? Uh, both sophomores. So yeah, that, yeah so sophomores and juniors, yeah. It's like 15, 16. Mm -hmm. And let's talk a little bit more about that team component. How big is the boys' soccer team? How big is the girls' soccer team? Yeah, boys, uh, we play in the fall, so there's 40, 40 players, uh, 20 JV, 20 varsity. Both guys were varsity players, uh, sophomores. And, you know, as a, as a program, you know, your, your sport becomes a family. So uh, we're a soccer family, and, and so anytime one's affected, we're, we're all affected. And so, um, yeah, we're, I mean, we're hurting. As a community, as a family, we're hurting right now. You said you heard yesterday morning. About what time did you get the news? Um, late, late afternoon, five, five, six, six o'clock. Yeah. Take me back to that, if you don't mind, Jimmy. What the emotion was like when you got the phone call, text, whatever it was. Yeah, we we were at a tournament or a couple games in Louisville this past week, so we got home from Saturday night from playing, and then a church Sunday morning, and then I went to the Ozarks. And right when I got to the Ozarks, I got a phone call that there had been an accident, so I instantly came back, and so. Um, you know, just a lot of a lot of things were flying around, but whenever I finally, you know, heard for sure, I mean, it's it's tragic. I mean, it's it's not it's not, it's not how it's supposed to be. You know, 15 year olds aren't supposed to to die like this. So um, we're we're hurting. I mean, families hurting, the the community's hurting. Um, it's a it's a very difficult time for us. Do we know yet if there was obviously it's Labor Day weekend, people are driving all over the place, vacation. The, what the other driver was doing, if they were impacted. I don't, yeah, I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know. I don't know any of the, those kind of details or anything like that. Anything would be speculation, so I don't know. So we'll leave that as a sure. one to ask yeah. just in case. How do you even prepare for something like this, Jamie, where you're talking to all these kids and you said beautiful words about coming together, leaning on each other. How do you even come to terms with where to start with something like this? Uh, sometimes you don't have to say words. Sometimes it's just being there, being present. Uh, I think that's the biggest thing right now is just being present for one another and and uh, being an outlet. I mean, there's there's so many emotions that that go with this, and so um, being able to be there and not isolate ourselves that, to me that's the key. So getting these guys to lean in and uh, love on one another, and so. Yeah. And I know you're leaning on faith right now a lot. Passages that come to mind, motifs, themes. Sure. When it comes to something like that. Yeah, I mean we're we're not promised, uh, you know, uh, a walk in the park. We're 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 told, you know, in the word that Jesus said, in this world you're gonna have trouble, um, but take hold. I, I'm with you, and so uh, that's our hope. Our hope is that God's with us. He walks with us. Psalm 23 tells us that. Uh, though we walk through the valley of shadow of death, he, he's with us. That's the promise of, of the Bible. Not that we won't go through things, but that God is with us. And so we know that. We, we feel that. Uh, we feel he's with us and he's strengthening us. And, and we strengthen by, we're strengthened, you know, by him so that we can strengthen others. And so that's the, that's the heart. I think that's such an important word is that strength. Just speak to how strong these kids are that you've seen in the last 24 hours when you're saying they're 14 or 15 years old and they're going through this right now. Well, you know, tragedy doesn't have a, a convenient time, you know, you drop everything. And so seeing these guys come together, seeing these guys uh, support one another, seeing these guys love on each other, I mean, it's uh, it's what I would expect from them because they're strong kids, but um, man, I'm blown away at the community support and just the way people are loving. And you'll see that visual too, like just people are really coming together. The next soccer game for boys, for girls, when's that supposed to be? And do we know yeah, gir there? girls is in the spring, so the uh, boys, we, we don't know. I mean, we're, we're making that decision. We're almost an hour at a time. We're making decisions, so we're supposed to play Wednesday night. I don't know that we will. I, I don't know any of those details. Let's talk about the funeral. I know you're a part of that organization. Anything in mind in terms of when that date's supposed to be, timing, anything like that? 
uh, I think we're having conversations about it. I know it'll be this week, and uh, yeah, I, I don't I don't know any details for sure though. Any, I know we were talking about this earlier. Any GoFundMe donation page yet, or is it all still too early? Yeah, I think it's still too early. Positions for the two players, obviously the one who passed away and then the one who walked away. Yeah, one's a uh, Crawford was a defender, and uh, a White plays up top and. Uh, more of an offensive player, fast, uh, both of them just incredible, uh, incredible young men. And uh, uh, it's it's tragic, it's sad, it's all of those things. Speak to what they were like as an athlete. You just said fast, which obviously yeah. with soccer I'd assume, but speak to them as just athletes. Uh, I mean, both, I mean, Crawford's a better kid than he was a soccer player. I mean, just the joy, a, a prankster, uh, just uh, always smiling, always just had... Uh, a smile on his face and just uh, a joy to be around and and that's 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 going to be missed for sure